This is the Specna Arms Core Series of AEGs. The question is, is the Specna Arms Core the best AEG you can get for under 200 bucks? Let's dive into it. So what are some of the notable features of the Core Series? Well, first you've got a nylon fiber reinforced upper and lower receiver, as well as most of the other furniture. All of it is a very nice polymer that's durable and lightweight. Of course, there is an adjustable hop-up, as you'd come to expect from most modern AEGs. This one is a rotary style and affixes to a metal barrel assembly, although the hop-up itself is polymer. Other great features of the Core Series are the factory-included ESA quick spring change system, allowing you to change in between FPS depending on where you're playing. And thankfully, guys at Specna have included a second spring out of the box. It comes installed with an outdoor spring, great for outdoor fields, as well as an indoor spring or closer engagement spring, depending on what field requirements you have. With the factory spring installed, we're seeing just under 380 FPS, which is right on Specna Arms claims. We're also seeing just under 18 rounds per second. Now that's with an 11.1 volt LiPo and 0.20 gram BBs. Pretty good. As you can see on semi and full auto, 50 feet, six inch plate, no problem at all for the core. Got good accuracy out of the box, a nice adjustable hop up means even if you're going to heavier weight BBs or shooting at farther distances, you're going to maintain a lot of that accuracy. This is, of course, pretty standard version 2 M4 setup, so upgrades are a plenty if you need to do them in the future. It's pretty easy to walk my shots in even at 100 feet. Yeah, you get a little bit more wayward shots, but six inch plate at 100 feet, still pretty good accuracy, considering most of the time you're gonna be shooting at targets that are people sized. So what do we think? Well, for under 200 bucks, you're getting quite a package here with plenty of performance, upgrade potential if you'd like to in the future, and a nice lightweight nylon fiber reinforced body. With that said, there's a couple things that I might change personally. I think I'd like to have a metal buffer tube for a little bit more durability. I like that the carry handle's removable so that I can add an optic if I want. And while clamshell handguards aren't exactly my style, there are other models in the lineup, both Rock River Arms and standard Specna licensed, that give you a lot more customizability in terms of the front end. Because ultimately, it's an M4, and you can do a lot with them for not a whole lot of money. The performance out of the box is nice, the accuracy is pretty good, the rate of fire is not bad either. And all of those things combined make for a very attractive package at under 200 bucks, regardless of what model you're looking at. So now that we know a little bit more about the Specna Arms Core Series, the question remains, is it the best AEG you can get for under 200 bucks? Let us know what you guys think in the comments.